Welcome to News 3. I'm Kurt Williams. Topping our headlines, police are searching for a suspect in a double shooting. It happened in Newport News Thursday afternoon on 17th Street in the city's east end. Police say two teenage boys were hit and that one may not survive. Both had multiple gunshot wounds and were rushed to the hospital. The suspect, according to police, ran from the scene and police are still looking for him. A break in at a gun shop in Virginia Beach under investigation. It happened at DOA Arms Gun Shop. Police say more than 20 guns were taken. The Virginia Beach Police Department currently partnering with the ATF and the National Center for Tracing Guns on this case. State health officials announced the first case of the Omicron variant in Virginia. It was identified in a sample from an adult living in the northwest part of the state. Health officials say the person had no history of international travel but did have a history of domestic travel during the exposure period. The Associated Press is reporting 43 cases in 19 states. Stay with News 3 for updates on this story. Time now for a check on your forecast with Chief Meteorologist Patrick Rock. Well, hey, Kurt, it was downright frigid when many of us woke up this morning in the 20s. There was frost on your car, chances are. So it will be cold when you wake up on Friday morning, but not nearly as cold. As a matter of fact, we do expect temperatures will be rising a few degrees. So we're going to bottom out this evening and see our temperatures rise a few degrees toward tomorrow morning. In fact, could be a little bit of patchy fog developing as we head overnight and toward tomorrow morning. Temperatures in the upper 30s and low 40s as we kick off your Friday. But by the afternoon, check that out, 62 degrees. Now we're saying some spotty showers around for tomorrow. Our forecast models have been going back and forth, so it could be a little bit heavier late in the afternoon and into the evening hours on Friday, but should move in and out pretty quickly. On Saturday, we are, we're going to be dry through most of the day, but rain arriving around midnight and sticking around into early on Sunday could even be a few thunderstorms. We'll go from 75 on Saturday to 52 degrees on Sunday.